You've been asking for this one for a long time, so here it finally is. How to decorate a Christmas tree. Step one, start with any type of long string of garland you want to add. I tuck mine in really deep and do it in kind of a zigzag pattern. Step two, instead of just winding ribbon around and around, try these six techniques instead. Cut a small piece of ribbon. Tuck one end deep into a tree branch, then let the ribbon form a nice loop and tuck the other end into another branch. Using a longer piece of ribbon, three feet maybe, tuck one end into the branch, loop it to another branch, twist the ribbon a full 360 degrees, tuck that part into the tree branch, then keep going until all the ribbon is placed. Make two or three loops of ribbon with a tail off one end and staple through those layers. Smush this into a hole in the Christmas tree, fluff it out, and it looks like a fancy bow. Make one loop, but then leave a tail sticking out for a bit of variety and extra cuteness. Tie a piece of florist wire into the center of a ribbon, then use the florist wire to attach that center part to a branch, tucking in those two loose ribbon ends into other branches. Twirl the ribbon around before tucking it in to make a cute little curl. So now let's talk about overall ribbon placement. Here's the general shape you're going for. You really just want the ribbon to go in different directions. Step three, add your largest ornaments and stagger them at different heights. I try to look for natural holes in the branches to fill in with these. Step four, add all of your medium and small ornaments. The trick to making these look good is to hang them at different depths. Step five, add some natural elements, greenery, twigs, berries, anything like that. Then don't forget a tree topper and some kind of tree skirt or collar to finish it all off. I always wait to turn on the lights until I've totally finished and cleaned up. It's like my little reward. All of these tips are written out in great detail on my site with example photos and so much information. So be sure to head over there and check it out. The link is in the comments or in my profile. Happy crafting!